Once upon a time, in the bustling port city of Genoa, Italy, a boy named Christopher Columbus was born in 1451. From an early age, he was captivated by the sea. His father, a wool weaver, had little means to support his dreams, but young Columbus was determined to explore the world beyond the horizon. By the age of 14, he had already embarked on his first maritime adventures, sailing along the coasts of Europe and gaining invaluable experience. As he grew older, Columbus became fascinated by tales of distant lands filled with riches, spices, silks, and gold. He believed that by sailing west across the Atlantic Ocean, he could find a new route to Asia. However, convincing the powerful monarchs of Europe to finance his expedition proved to be a daunting task. After years of seeking support, he finally gained the favor of King Ferdinand and Queen Isabella of Spain in 1492. On August 3rd of that year, Columbus set sail from Palos de la Frontera with three ships, the Nina, the Pinta, and the Santa Maria. The journey was fraught with uncertainty and fear as his crew sailed into uncharted waters. After weeks at sea, on October 12th, land was sighted a small island in the Bahamas that Columbus named San Salvador. He believed he had reached the East Indies and referred to the indigenous people he encountered as Indians. Columbus's voyages continued as he explored various islands in the Caribbean and claimed them for Spain. His discoveries opened the door for European exploration and colonization, but also brought devastating consequences for the native populations. Despite his initial success, Columbus faced numerous challenges during his later voyages. His settlement struggled with conflict and discontent among both settlers and indigenous peoples. In 1500, after a series of misfortunes and complaints against his governance in Hispaniola, Columbus was arrested and returned to Spain in chains. Though stripped of his titles and authority, his spirit remained unbroken. He made one last voyage in 1502, exploring parts of Central America before returning to Spain for good. Christopher Columbus died on May 20, 1506, still convinced that he had found a new route to Asia. His legacy is complex. While celebrated for his daring explorations that connected two worlds, it is also marked by the profound impact on indigenous peoples and cultures. Today, Columbus is remembered not just as an explorer, but as a figure whose journeys forever altered the course of history. As night fell over Genoa many years later, tales of Columbus's adventures continued to inspire dreamers and explorers alike, reminding all that sometimes the greatest discoveries come from daring to venture into the unknown.